Harper pretty much comes down to your uh, to your uh, spotted marsh goose. There's uh, fewer than 900 of the geese left out in his, these parts in these woods, and uh, when these woods are gone, uh, you can pretty much plant uh, plant a kiss on a fanny at a spotted uh, marsh goose. You know, that, that would be a shame as far as I'm concerned, because nothing more beautiful than seeing one of them big birds just take off out of the marsh in the morning. It'd be one thing if they were, you know, hunting for food, but it's the senseless killing that I got a problem with. <laughs> Well, you gotta realize you can't, you can't just take uh, one element out of the ecosystem. You got your, uh, you got your fly, your mosquito, you got your elm beetle, and uh, you take them so pretty much you're up to your eyeballs and bugs. Well, that may very well be. Yet the loggers contend that the economy of Green Ridge is dependent upon the very clearing of the forest. Oh, well, short term, you're talking a few jobs, maybe 150 new jobs. That's kind of a pain if you're out of work. But uh, the state also depends on its nature reserves and tourist dollars, and that's kind of important too. You cut these trees back, they're not coming back, you know. Yes, this is obviously a very touchy and sensitive issue. Uh -huh. Loggers have been clashing with conservationists right here in these very woods. <laughs> of violence lately. Well, uh, you know, I can like you, you know, uh, tempers are flaring high and we've been able to keep things civilized so far, but I can't guarantee you it's going to stay like that, you know. So the loggers are not going to give up these woods without a fight. Well, miss, I'm from Green Ridge and I know lumberjacks. They like to get liquored up and they like to, they like to fight. They're Scandinavians and they're mean, you know, and they are. Well, is the Department of the Interior close to making a decision in this matter? Well, uh, to tell you the truth, uh, we're not holding our breath out here, you know. Yeah, so you're saying you, you expect the federal bureaucracy to take its sweet time. <laughs> Well, there's a stall. bear dump in the woods. <laughs> yes, well, thank you, Ranger McDermott, very much. And uh, through it all, the spotted marsh goose flies peacefully overhead, unaware that their fate is being decided in Washington as we speak. For Fox News, this is Jennifer Moss, Green Ridge Forest.